Hello guys, welcome to this video in which I'm going to show you how to change the TDP configuration on mobile Ryzen APUs. I'm using the Ryzen 5 2500. Uh, right now you can see a gameplay in Warzone on stock 15 watt TDP. It's just averaging around 8 up to 9 FPS, so in fact the game is completely unplayable on 15 watt. So I changed the configuration on the system to 25 watts. You can see uh, right now the gameplay and I managed to average around 32 FPS. So that's a huge increase to the 10 FPS on uh, yeah 15 watts. So, um, what do you need to do? Uh, first, I'm going to show you the standard configuration. I'm using the tool AMD UProf to check the current value. Um, it's on 15 watt, of course, and yeah, the fast limit is 25, but of course, it's never reaching this limit. So, um, first of all, you've got to check two things. You should be running on the latest BIOS version for your device. Uh, I'm using an HP laptop, so I'm going to the HP homepage and searching for the latest BIOS version. So you click on laptop. In, in fact, on every manufacturer page, it's working like the same you enter your serial number and you get the latest drivers and also bias versions uh, by the way never download uh, the amd driver from um, your manufacturer page always use the amd home page so here's our bias version it's the f.22 ref a revision a um, I'm not going to download this now because uh, I've already installed it of course and I'm going to show you this in the program CPU set it's in here it's already on the F22 now. so I don't need to download it anymore and install it but um, if you haven't already upgraded your BIOS version you should do this first so after upgrading your BIOS, you go into your AMD driver and you check uh, this version. I'm also already running on the latest version, but um, yeah, if you're not, of course, also upgrade your driver. So after doing these two things, it's basically a small preparation. Um, you can start on changing your TDP configuration. We need two programs, AMD UProf, as I already showed you. It's a, just a check tool, and uh, Ryzen Adjust is the tool that you're going to need to change the TDP configuration. So right now I'm searching for it. <coughs> I'm using the GitHub project page to download it. Uh, 0.5.2 is the latest version. So. I'm downloading this right now. Um, you need to choose the Win64 release.zip. So click on it and download. It's already on my desktop, so I don't need to do this. After downloading the Ryzen Adjust, you need uh, UProf. It's um, from the official and the developer page. In fact, you can do tons of shit with this <laughs> program. Yeah, you can energy, you can analyze energy consumption, or uh, yeah, it's really uh, a mighty tool. But uh, it's also good enough for us. 
to check the current TDP configuration. So you're downloading the uh, uh, file, and I'm just showing you. Click on accept and download it to your folder. So after doing this, um, you can go directly into the Ryzen Adjust folder and yeah, I already created some batch files in here. If you're starting it first, um, you just have the demo file. Um, it's in fact I think it's a 40 watt TDP configuration so you can already start the demo file but um, yeah we can now just have a look in it yeah it's 40 watt and fast limit is 45 slow limit also 45 and temp is at 90 degree Celsius um, what worked best for me was a 25 watt configuration so I changed the values to um, 25 of course as uh, STAPM and also fast limit 25 slow limit and then I um, took 95 degree Celsius as temperature so right now I'm showing you um, how to create a new batch file I'm doing a 25 watt new so in fact you can uh, copy everything from the demo file and just adjust um, yeah, the values you want to change. As, or, as I already said, 25 watt worked best for me. Uh, increasing it to 40 watt, I um, had some problems um, holding the clock rate. Uh, GPU clock rate uh, yeah, wasn't able to hold its value uh, so I got a lot of stutters in games and 25 watts yeah, worked best for me so I'm um, just using this in fact you've got to find out for yourself what's best for you uh, yeah. and to run this uh, you've got to right click on it and run it as admin so, batch file is open and you can close the window so after applying your new TDP configuration you've got to check it if um, yeah if your PC is using it so you need the program MDU prof starting it have a look at these values. You are, we are on our STAPL limit 25 watt. That's the important one. Right now on Windows, it's just using 15 watt. And yeah, it also took the rest on 25 watts. So everything is fine. Uh, we can close it, stop profile and close view. And yeah, that's it. It's pretty easy. Just be sure to um, keep an eye on your temperatures. So thank you guys for watching this benchmark. Uh, I think it's yeah good enough to squeeze out some performance on every mobile Ryzen system. This method is working on Ryzen from the second generation and the third generation. The new Ryzen fourth generation is already having a um, yeah, TDP configuration in stock. So if you're using a Ryzen uh, 4800 in you, you can already decide if you want to run on stock 15 watt or 25 or even 35 watt. So yeah, on the fourth generation, you don't need the Ryzen adjust. But uh, yeah, I would recommend to install AMDU Prof on every system because it's really interesting uh, to know your current power consumption. So yeah, that's it. Let's call it a day. And thanks for watching. I'll leave a like and subscribe if you like this video. And see you in the next one.